Hi, I'm Matt Wood, the leader of learning innovation here at Billanook College, and I'd like to introduce to you our brand new My Billanook Parent app. Now, upon logging in using your Billanook Parent username and password, that's the same credentials that you'd use for Billanook Connect or Parent Lounge, you'll come to the following screen. Now, first of all, you'll see a dialog box open here with the name of your child, or if you have more than one child at the college, you'll see them there. That allows you to choose and toggle between children to see each other's information. So if you just click anywhere outside of that, that will remove the dialog box. So what we can see here is what's called the home screen. So here you can see the day's date, the current time, and we've got three different sections across the bottom with a summary snapshot of all your child's relevant information. So the first block we can see at the bottom left is the timetable block. So this is a live timetable for your child for this particular day. So you can see here each of the subjects that the child has scheduled for that day. And if you hover over those, they allow you to actually click and that will bring up specific information about that particular class. The next block here is called the homework block. And here you can see all current homework tasks that your child's teacher has set for them. And again, you can hover over those and click those to see the specific homework task and what it entails. And then finally, the third block is called the notices block. And this is where teachers can send messages, so can push out messages to students or to classes about little reminders, i.e. bring your sports uniform, don't forget to bring your lab coat, things like that. So at this stage, this student has no current notices. So again, this is the home screen and it's a general snapshot of all your child's current daily information. Now to view further information, and we will work through these, if you move your mouse over to the far left corner, you'll see these three lines here. Okay, if you click that, you will see a number of tabs appear and we'll work through each of those tabs. So the first one you can see is the home button and by clicking that, that just takes us back to the home screen. So the first one is the calendar part and if we click on the calendar part, up comes your child's timetable for the week. So we can see the day, the lesson, the teacher, the room, and the period. And we can flick through over in the right hand side here to the following week and vice versa. Now also, if we click this little calendar icon in the top right, we can actually toggle between the student's timetable, but also school calendar events as well. And they'll just overlay over the top. So when there are excursions and things like that. Okay. Back to the menu tab, the next section is the homework part. So here we can see a list of all your child's subjects and this number here is the number of homework tasks for that particular subject. So you can see here, here is a list of homework and it's actually, you can click the specific task, it will expand it. Okay, so here you can see the title of the homework task. Okay, over here is the subject that was set, the nature of the task, and the due date. So anything in red shows that the student has not yet ticked off that they have completed it. Okay, when they actually tick to say that they've completed it, it will go over to their completed section. So if I click the completed section, you can see here is a full list of current homework that the child has said that they've com completed. Back to the due tab, you can see here. So at this stage, there are two outstanding tasks by this student and four upcoming tasks. Okay. Back to the menu tab, notices. 
Again, this is where teachers can send messages to students and classes about little reminders. At this stage, there are no notices here, but they would appear in this section. Back to the menu tab. Parent lounge, okay, is a quick uh, access point to parent lounge to look at things like progressive assessments, uh, to book parent-teacher conferences, things like that. Just going to close that. Um, we've got Bill and Connect. Again, just a quick link to take you to Bill and Connect. Daily bulletins. So here you can have a look at the daily bulletins that the students are encouraged to read first thing in the morning when they arrive at school. And in this in and currently you can see there are senior and middle school daily notices available to read. There are also Bill and Oak bulletins. So the current newsletters that are sent out uh, appear here, and you've got a full archive, so you can go back and have a look at past bulletins. And then finally, policies. You can see here is a full list of current school rules and policies. So I'm just going to go back to the home screen. So essentially, that's my Billanook in a quick tour. New functionalities that go that it's going to be added in the coming weeks includes the ability to view on mobile smartphone, also the ability to notify student absences through the app, and also the ability to accept permission for excursions and other off-site activities. So again, that's my Billanook. I really hope you enjoy it. It's designed to connect parents in with their children's learning so they can follow, monitor and assist. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact our ICT services team and you can access them via email at ictservices at billanook.vic.edu.au. Again, I'm Matt Wood, the leader of learning innovation here at Billanook College and I really hope you enjoy this exciting new app. Thank you.